Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I wanted to share with you how to paint a leopard print on your phone case. It's actually pretty easy and fast. So I'm gonna be using this phone case. It's pretty old and used. It used to be clear and nice, like yellowish. I'm going to be using as well my brush, that vintage white acrylic paint, brown acrylic paint as well. First, I'm going to be customizing my own shade right here, mixing my vintage white acrylic paint, some brown, and just a bit of yellow, like a few drops of it. And then I'm going to be painting my phone case. I'm going to be giving this fake coats until it's like opaque and letting it dry like so. Now for the center of the spots, I'm going to be mixing some orange, brown, and some like vintage white that I used a tiny bit until I have like a new shade of brown. So it's pretty much this brownish mustardy. And then I'm just going to be placing the spots all over the place, different sizes, different shapes, even doing that all over my phone case. If you're shaking, it can help because they're not perfect circles. Then I'm going to be taking some black acrylic paint, my tiny brush, and I'm going to be adding the details on like the edges. It's pretty much like this, like two uneven circles or just a circle. And it's not like a thin line. It's kind of hard to explain how the um, edges and the spots, but hopefully you can get an idea by looking at what I'm doing. But just pretty random, uneven, and when it's like undone, looks even better. So like my head got in the way with my messy hair. It was like humid days, that's why my hair looks crazy. And yeah, here I went back and forth and just making the lines thicker. I'm going to add some like gloss. I'm using this glaze glass and my brush. I prefer honestly like a spray ones because then you don't see like the brush strokes all over the place. But yeah, this one is not as bad and doesn't smell. It doesn't take as long to dry as well. And I really like how this one looks with this one. I feel like it uh, looks a bit more printed as opposed to painted. Giving this a few coats until it was like protected and shiny. But yeah, this is pretty much the design that I wanted to share with you. I love it. It's one of my favorite ones so far. It was really easy to make, honestly. I was skeptical, to be honest. I didn't want to give it a try because I thought the spots had to be perfect. But the less perfect you make them, the cooler they look. I know this print is like on staff right now. I wanted to give it a try because I love the print. I wanted to show you how to paint your own in case you want to go for it. I don't have any leopard print like top. This is pretty much the only thing that I have. But yeah, I feel like it's a party right now so i'll just move on to the phone case itself but yeah hopefully you like this if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more phone cases that i have on my channel and subscribe for more let me know what you think of this one and don't forget to share it but yeah thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye guys